Welcome guys to a brand new video on solo leveling arise. Now in today's video what we want to do is take a look at the maintenance because tomorrow or as in two days time we are going to be getting a new banner and we're going to be getting a lot of interesting changes as well. Now in today's video we're going to be taking a look at everything that's coming out however we are still going to be getting a patch note uh, when the update actually goes live so wait for a video on that as well but hopefully you guys enjoyed this video stay tuned for more content on solo leveling arise. Now we Within this video, in the comment section, you will find 200 codes. So go ahead and use those codes. Um, 200 codes, go ahead and actually, no, 400 codes. 400 codes, 200 will be for the 1k essence stones, and 200 will be for the rune fragments and the advancement stuff. So enjoy the codes and let's get right into the video. If you want to get yourself codes every single time, then what you guys need to do is go ahead and support the channel. Press the support um, button. Um, in the official content creator program for Netmarble and go ahead and support the channel and if you guys haven't gotten a code reach out to me on discord the discord information is in the uh, description of this video okay so let's get right into it so the regular maintenance notice so greetings hunters the hunter association has a notice for you so regular maintenance on the 10th of uh, June and let's take a look at how long the maintenance is going to be so from the 9th of 9th of june all the way to the 10th of uh, 10th it looks like it's a damn it's like seven hour maintenance yeah it's a seven hour maintenance seven or eight hour maintenance that's crazy that's crazy okay so it's a seven hour maintenance the stuff that is coming out is a new hunter ssr yu sun yu and exclusive weapon ssr overdrive added new weapon for song jin ru oh my days no we have to go through this again i will probably not be able to get this weapon is the ssr phoenix soul added new costumes as well battlefields of trial challenge added sr hunter exclusive weapon we what added okay hunter archive new stories and secret library added hunter and room skill balance adjustments new events added new packages added and system improvements and bug fixes so those are the main parts of the maintenance however we will get a detailed one a much detailed one when the update goes live and i hate how they do that though because i want to see all the detailed information at least two days before the maintenance goes live not on the day when the game opens up it, it, it's kind of annoying when they do that that way because we don't even know what the ssr yunsu who does except to take a look at leaks um the ssr phoenix soul is probably going to be a decent weapon but of course since you can only get one copy well depending on how much summons you do you might only get one copy uh it's probably going to be a weapon you don't use that much but it is going to be a fire weapon based on the name so ssr phoenix so phoenix is usually vermilion bird fire bird so yeah it should be a fire weapon and i think we already have information on that weapon not from the game not from the devs even i'm telling you the devs release stuff without actually giving us information on what those stuff are um new costume added we already know this is because of the new um, new stories so they already previously mentioned this in the developer notes um i am a little bit confused on the sr onto exclusive weapon added because i'm pretty sure we already have wait a minute is are we getting an SR character? No. So why are they saying SR Hunter exclusive weapon added? We already have SR exclusive Hunter exclusive weapons already, don't we? Don't we? Actually, do we not? Actually, I don't even know. I don't think we do, actually. Yeah, for SR units, I don't think we do. Huh. But okay, I don't even use that many SR units, so I'm not sure if this is going to be beneficial to me. But okay. Um, Actually, this SR weapon could actually make the SR units become actually crazy. So... It's something we have to take a look at as well especially for the two like amazing uh sr units so the the lady that freezes i forgot the name and we also have uh kim Chol, i think his name is the one that has a big ass shield oh and we also have other um, sr units that inflict bleed as well so if the weapon enhances the bleed capability they could actually become crazy um what i'm really interested in though is of course what is it the new hansa of course that's pretty much it we're obviously going to get new events um again from the previous developer notes we know that we should not be um fusing our uh ruins or our blessing stones do not do that just yet and also do not use 
your summons if you are spending on the hunter association uh you know subscription package stuff do not use your summons right now wait until the 16th and then you can go ahead and use your summons because by then you will be able to get two ssrs in one multi and i believe they might also be upgrading the the list of characters and uh, stuff we might be getting in that as well so please do not do that okay so that's pretty much it um ending content uh, we would like to inform you of contents that are ending. So, of course, we know the events that are ending is to do with Melin Fisher. So, that's ending. We also have uh, Proof of Illusion Libora Rate of Draw event ending. Pit a Pat Treasure Hunt um, event going away. May Salvage Project. I'm hoping that the devs actually change the Salvage Project stuff because it's it's very annoying right now. I can't even lie. So, I hope they improve this. Uh, many Fisher exclusive weapon pack. Ooh, I don't care. I don't care. Hunter pass. Nope. 50 day shops as well. Total purchase counts in a bonus tab on the shop. Oh yeah, this time I didn't even bother with the bonuses. And moving forward, I probably will not be bothered with, you know, up, um, buying stuff in the bonus shop as well. Uh, mana power imbued fragments dice events is going away. Treasure hunt events are going away as well. So pay attention to that um bonus tab reset so it's resetting i wonder what type of characters we're going to be getting now uh we don't know okay revamped packages oh certain packages are getting revamped we are updating the contents and prices of the packages listed below hunters who purchased this packages are are progressing through missions before will receive all rewards for incomplete missions okay um i'm pretty sure i bought some of these packs already on some, yeah, I did, I did, I did. Hard mode. Actually, maybe not. But yeah, I think I should be getting more. But this packs again revamped. I'm guessing they mean they're going to be adding more stuff or improving the rewards. I am not really too sure. But I'll take that. I, I do believe they will give me compensation because I did buy some of the packs. Uh, maintenance compensation. We have 500 essence stones, two gate keys, weapon enhancement gear two, and the hunter archive keys as well. This is going to be beneficial because you can get skins now. So, very, very important. Um, that is pretty much it. But again, look forward to future stuff coming to the game. Um, I'm pretty sure there might be more stuff coming in, in July though. So, we still have the improvements to character skill. Because the devs already mentioned that they do want to buff up certain characters. Um, the challenge, uh, the battlefield of... Is it Chaos? the one where we can get gems they need to add the mileage system or i don't know if it's already in the game already but i'm pretty sure they mentioned something about mileage system for that as well i'm looking forward to the new events there is going to be a weapon growth event as well so please do not upgrade any weapons right now do not limit break any weapons just yet wait for the maintenance to actually happen and regarding the character that is coming out again of course i will be testing out the character going over whether or not you should summon for her so stay tuned for that video as well uh, you might want to skip a herd though because we do know that we are getting an S rank hunter uh, very very soon. Ah, by the way, it did not even mention guild in this maintenance or oh, this notice. So that's a little bit weird, I'm not going to lie. There is a couple of stuff missing in this maintenance which is confusing me because I'm pretty sure they said guild is coming in early July. But I might be wrong, they might release it late July after all. Um, we have to wait and see. But I'm pretty sure there are some stuff missing from this notice. So we have to wait and see until the official update goes live tomorrow. So is it tomorrow or the day after? I can't really remember. Oh, I am going out on Thursday. So I'm really hoping it's not on Thursday. I'm hoping it makes sense not on Thursday. So I can make videos already. Anyways, don't forget to like and subscribe. It's been your boy AC Gamer. Enjoy the 400 codes in the comment section. Again, support the channel by liking the video. Let's get this video to 50... Uh, 50 50 um, likes and uh, keep sub subscribing to the channel. It's been your boy AC Gamer, and I'm out.